back to my channel i hope you're doing well so in this video i'm going to talk about retin a or tretinoin and how you can get retin a cheaply or affordably if you live in the united states so um i'm going to talk about that in this video so if this is something that you're interested in please keep on watching so before we get into the topic make sure you like this video and make sure you subscribe to my channel i would appreciate that very much and of course turn on the bell notification so that you know when i upload a new video so let's talk about retin a and how to get retin a cheaply without a prescription if you live outside of the us so first things first just a quick disclaimer if you are not going to use sunscreen if you do not plan to use sunscreen if you don't already use sunscreen if you um, have never used any type of retinol before if you have never exfoliated before listen if you have never done any skincare procedure or anything like that or treatment where sunscreen sunscreen is required please do not go and buy retin a and then come back and blame me when it all goes wrong because that's not going to happen i'm not going to tolerate that at all <laughs> so i just wanted to make sure that i put that disclaimer out there uh to be honest i do not like suggesting or recommending products that can be easily misused i don't even like recommending chemical peels i don't like recommending glycolic acid i really don't like to because a lot of people do not listen so um you are gonna find that if you live in a country where you need a prescription to get retin a the doctor is gonna ask you about your skincare routine etc and if you do not use sunscreen or any of that stuff they may just tell you to just get retinols or they may not even prescribe you their their retin a so i just wanted to get it out of the out of the way if you do not plan to use sunscreen every single day please do not bother so now that that is out of the way because i had to say something let's talk about uh, retin a so recently i started my retin a journey i switched from retinols to retin a uh because you know i i felt like i wasn't getting the results that i was looking for when using retinols i mean yes the, my skin looked great and everything like that but i felt like you know i could get my skin to the next level if you know what i mean i wanted to get my skin to the next level and I was looking at my options and I decided to just, you know, jump right in and get the retin-A. Um, in my country, I do not need a prescription to get retin-A. So if you live in Trinidad or in the Caribbean or whatever, and you want to get your hands on retin-A, all you have to do is go to the, the pharmacy and just get it at the pharmacy and you're good to go. And I paid the equivalent of 23 US dollars for this tube of retin-A yeah so i paid the equivalent of 23 us dollars for this tube so um i had no idea how expensive retin a was in the united states and the uk because when i found that out i was shocked i was shocked i was i was like i couldn't believe it uh people are paying up to 150 dollars a tube some people are paying more in the in the united kingdom people i saw a lady that paid like a hundred dollars not a hundred dollars a hundred pounds for a tube of retin a and the tube was smaller than this one and i couldn't believe it i was like wow i can't believe that you guys have to go through this and i had no idea how lucky i was because honestly i thought everyone was paying the same literally like the same price for retin a um unfortunately that is not the case because when i purchased a retin a i immediately had a bunch of people um coming in my dms and asking me where did i get it if i needed a prescription how much did i pay for it yada yada and that's when i found out how expensive it is in the united states and the uk if you live in the united the united states of course you have to get um, a prescription and a dermatologist fee is not cheap um so i've heard and also i heard that it is not covered by insurance if you're over the age of 25 because if you're under the age of 25 if a dermatologist is prescribing retin a they usually prescribe in retin a for acne but if you don't if you if you're over the age of 25 and up you know um most people who are using tretinoin are using it for anti-aging purposes and they don't look they don't look at it as a medical treatment anymore they look at it as more like a cosmetic treatment 
if you're over the age of 25. So there's that. That that's um so that's an issue. So most like most likely if you live in the United States and you go through the process of getting getting to a dermatologist, getting a prescription, um your most likely your insurance company will not cover you. This is what I've heard and this is what I'm, you know, just bringing back to you guys because you ladies um and guys spoke to me and I was like, "Guys, I'm still in shock." So now that I cover that, I think I think I said pretty much what I wanted to say. So, how do you get affordable retinae? Let's say you do have a prescription. You can get um, retinae in Canada. You can get someone, if you know someone that is going to um, somewhere like Canada or Mexico, because medical tourism is a thing. Med medical, tour medical tourism is a thing. It really is. It's a big business. It's a multi-billion dollar business. People travel all over the world to get um, medical treatment, cosmetic treatment, etc. So a lot of people will go, if you live in the United States, you can just get on a plane or just cross the border and go to any pharmacy and get your hands on some Retin-A and you can get it pretty cheap. So if you know someone that is going to Mexico, I would recommend that you ask them to get you some Retin-A and get you as many as you can. If you know someone going to Canada, you can also find out if they can get you some Retin-A as well. You can also get Retin-A online. I am not going to recommend any online website here on my channel because I cannot vouch for any of those websites. Like I cannot because I haven't purchased from those websites. I wouldn't recommend a website that I haven't purchased from. So just so you all know, every single website that I um, I recommend on this channel, I have actually purchased from these people. I've actually done business with these people, bought stuff, had um, an experience, etc. Um, I'm sure you can find, um, you can go on Google or you can find people on YouTube that will recommend websites. Um, some people even recommend eBay, but I would not recommend any websites because I do not want anything coming back to me. So just so you guys know, but you can definitely get Retin-A on online pharmacies. There are many online pharmacies online that you can get Retin-A. And I know there's a concern about it being fake or whatnot. Um, first of all, if you are one of those people that are like, oh, you should not, you should not buy um, medical um, products or, and I shouldn't even call it, this is not a medical product, this is a skincare product, but, you know, in the United States, it is seen as medical. Outside of the, outside of my, outside of the country, in my country, it's just um, a topical skincare treatment that you can get at the pharmacy. Get online, look around. If you are not in my skincare group, I will recommend that you join my skincare group. Hit the link below and come join. And I'm sure you can ask questions in there because I've seen some people recommended some websites in my group where they can get um, cheap retin-A. Also, there, I am also in a tretinoin group on Facebook. It's a pretty big group and there's a lot of resources in that group as well. I'm going to link that group below as well so you can join my group and you can also join that other group if you would like to learn more and if you can if you would like to find a place where you can, you know, get retin-A. I think that's pretty much it. That's how you can get um retin-A without a prescription. You can go online if you want to get it cheaply. I think she wants to come outside. That's my that's my niece. If you want to get it um if you do not want to pay if you do not want to pay $150 for a tube of Retin-A and you know someone that is coming to the Caribbean or you know someone that is visiting Mexico or whatnot, just get them to get you the Retin-A. The next time you travel, try and get it. But you know, if you like, if you like my close friend and you know, you live out there and you want me to get some for you, I will definitely get some for you. But other than that, um, I think that's all I wanted to share. I wanted to come on here really quickly and share that. Good luck, guys. Good luck with everything. Good luck on your retin A, tretinoin journey. Good luck with getting retin A that is affordable because everybody deserves affordable treatments, medical treatments, um, skincare treatments. Everybody deserves affordable treatment. I think it's um, ridiculous because, you know, the, the medical industry in first world countries like the United States and the UK is so corrupt and it amazes me that you guys have to jump through so many hoops just to get your hands on a tube of retin a it amazes me that you know you have to go through that and i really do feel for you guys but you have to understand that there are always alternatives where there's a will there's a way 
once you want to get something uh, ain't no red tape or anything like that is going to stop you from getting it if you really want it so yeah um that's it for this video and i'll see you guys in another video bye